now uh, we have already done this problem of triangle now there is some restriction on the arrangement now how do we do that how many words can be formed from the letters of the word triangle that we have already discussed there are eight letters so eight factorial base will be there now how many of these will begin with t and end with e right now we have eight places one two three four five six seven eight at this place t is fixed and at this place e is fixed now we have uh, left uh, we are left with six places and six letters so six places and six letters they can be arranged in six factorial that is 720 ways when we were having no restriction in the previous case the ways were eight factorial now there is a restriction that the first letter should be t and the last letter should be e right so we got the ways reduced because now we are left with the six positions uh, and we have to arrange the six letters so this is the second case i would like to share the third case also when it is told that t and e uh, should be uh, at the extreme places that means this is the first position this is the last position so we call them extreme positions right now if the question is that t and e should be at extreme position that means at the first place t and the last place e or at the first place e last place t so that is also acceptable right so for that also six factorial ways will be there but at the first place e and the last place t is there so t and e can be arranged in two ways t and e or e and t right so in all for the third case 720 into 2 that is 1440 ways will be there so you got the three questions in this particular uh, question first is no restriction that is eight factorial ways will be there and the second case the first position should be taken by t and the last position should be taken by e and the third case which i created the problem over here that is the extreme position should be taken by e and t that means t and e this combination is allowed as well as e and t this combination is also allowed right so for the third case we have the answer as 6 factorial into 2 and i am sure now you are clear uh, the difference among these three questions right now friends let's take uh, the set of problems here there are five conditions uh, so it will be good to solve this problem because various aspects we have to see so i think the concept will be cleared after we solve this problem right now how many words can be formed by the letters of the word walls when first of all we take there is no restriction so how many letters are there one two three four five six right uh, we have to choose all the letters because it's not mentioned that uh, how many letters we have to use so i assume that we have to use all the letters right so six letters that means six places to be filled up by six letters and there is no restriction that means there is six factorial ways right so the first problem is quite simple now let's come to the second problem it uh, each word begins with e right so we have six places i just do it over here one two three four five six right for the first place uh, we have restriction that we have single choice that number one should number i'm sorry letter e should come so we have just one choice for the first place because the word should begin with e so first place is fixed for e right now we have five places and uh, five letters left out so the five letters at five places can be arranged in five factorial ways that means 120 right now the next is so we are clear with this clear with this each word begins with o and ends with l right now further we have six places one two three four five six for the first place we have one choice that o should come for the last place we still have one choice that l should come now for the this uh, center place amid the places over here four places we are left and we are left with four letters so four places four letters four factorial ways will be there to arrange them right so that's 24 right so this is also clear now the next is all walls come together right now first of all uh, how many walls are there let's see v o w e l n s 
so two walls are there so what i do i just uh, take them as one uh, letter only so what i do is o e i treat it as one and v w l s so one two three four five now i am left with five letters now five letters can be arranged in five factorial ways right now here it is told that all walls should come together that means i have tied up or i have uh, combined o and e and getting five factorial ways but the other order is uh, o e and e o both the uh, orders are acceptable right so o and e can be arranged in two factorial ways so what we did at the first uh, case we arrange these five letters i am uh, taking this as one so 1 2 3 4 5 five factorial ways and uh, we arrange this five letters then in two factorial ways o and e both of them can be arranged right so it's 120 into 2 240 ways will be there right if it is mention that e should follow o then this only only five factorial ways will be there but if it is told that o a o and e should be together then there will be two factorial uh, ways multiplied by five factorial because o and e with this is also valid and e and o order is also valid right so o and e can be arranged in two factorial ways right now all the consonants come together right now uh we don't have to like uh, this uh, take o and e together now we have to take v w l n s s of one word then o and then e now we have three letters i am treating this as one only so 1 2 3 three letters can be arranged in three factorials now we have to keep the consonant together but the consonant can change the position inside right like they can change the in uh, in uh, among themselves they can change the position right that is v w l s or v l w s or s l w v or s w v l whatever whatever right so these four they while they are together they can also rearrange themselves right so these four can be arranged in four factorial ways among themselves right so first we did uh, we arrange this three letters then we arrange these four consonants among themselves in four factorial ways so 3 factorial into 4 factorial that is 6 into 24 so that is 144 ways are there will all the consonants will come together right so we discussed the five conditions and i hope you are clear now